Wilson. We are here with Husky senior Colton Tully Doyle. Broke the school record today in the 3,000 meters and got the NCAA auto mark. Uh, Colton, Coach Metcalf was talking about how it was. It wasn't a perfect race, so take us through how it went for uh, for you today. Uh, the first 800 meters was was pretty on. Uh, maybe even the first thousand, we had a rabbit. Max O'Donnell, he did a really good job, and then as soon as he dropped off the track. We just hit the brakes for some reason. I, I kind of clued into my to my splits, but they were all I mean they all started getting slower and slower. And then I went through 2K and 520, and then that's pretty much when I told myself that even though there were like 10 guys around me, that I better start kicking, and that's pretty much what I did. And it all ended up working out in the end, I guess. Yeah, I mean I had a lot left, so I mean maybe in a better race and a faster race, like you know I run a little bit faster, but. <laughs> In the end, yeah, I did exactly what I wanted to do. You know, I got my auto, so. Now, a year ago, uh, I mean, you were posting some really big times, but maybe a little bit of a surprise. I'm guessing today you went in kind of expecting to, to break the school record. Yeah, that was basically the expectation was that I go out and, like, I mean, it was the original plan was to try and run 7.48 or something like that. But, I mean, <clears throat> I got a little sick. I wasn't feeling perfect this week, so we just backed it off, and it was just go get an auto, so. I mean, I can't complain. I'm going to NCA, so. Now look ahead the next couple of weeks, uh, MPSFs, and obviously NCAs. Is there, is it going to be just focusing on the 3K? Do you think you'll run DMR also, or um, what's it looking like? I guess that remains to be seen. <laughs> I mean, I was supposed to anchor the DMR, but you know, we got a pretty good anchor in James Cameron, so maybe I won't. Maybe I'll just kind of get, you know, tuned up and queued up for NCAs. I mean. I'll probably run a mile to, to stay away from the 3K, but yeah. And then I guess lastly, just talk about, you know, the overall atmosphere in here today and being on the start line with, you know, some Olympians, some NCAA champions. Just what was it like to just be at this meet here today? Uh, it was incredible. I was hit number nine, and hit number eight was Alan Webb, and hit number ten was Ian Dawson. So <laughs> Metcalf introduced me to them just, you know, maybe like 30 seconds before the race. So, so you know, that was pretty intense, but... I mean, on the back stretch, I'm like I felt so good, and I mean, every it was probably the loudest race that I've ever been in, so that was extremely fun.